Okay, well, here we are now. Apple is with us. Bootsy's with us. Tag is with us. Boo is walking around. Anyway, girls, listen. Apple, listen. You can see, if you look around, that we have done the perimeter of the first row of boards all the way around the deck. That was the one that was the hardest because we had to make little notches for where the posts are and uh, do all kinds of fancy cutting and mitering at the corners and all that. But now we are ready to start laying planks. So I'm hoping with a nice sunny day like we have that we'll be able to get the boards laid down on the deck today and maybe by tonight you can use your doggy door again. I think I'm getting bored. Get it? Bored. Well, we got a nice sunny, breezy day and between all the rainy days we had, I've been able to actually get the uh, get the main part of the deck done. I will still have to do the side part of the deck and the step in front. But if you look closely, there's just one more little board to put in place, and this last board has been a little challenging because it has to be tucked underneath underneath the outer layer of the house the living area so that we get proper drainage and uh, that means ripping a piece of the regular width deck wood into a smaller width so I've got this piece cut to the proper length I have my table saw set to a three inch width so all I have to do is rip this. <sighs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh oh. I might have lost one. Oh, I think there's ten of them. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. I think I'm still missing one. I don't see it. We will fit this board into place, drill some pilot holes for the screws that hold it in. You can't use the uh, hidden fasteners over on the last board because you wouldn't be able to get it into place and then slip it into the hidden fasteners. So I use screws on those. I use one of the hidden fasteners as a spacer to make sure that I'm matching the gap with the other boards. And this section of the deck is officially done. Apple, thank you for all your help and keeping me company. We still have a lot to do. I kind of feel like a property brother at this point. I really am not. Although, this is my property, and I have a brother, not my twin. So I don't know how closely that qualifies me, but we're hanging in there, and I guess we'll have to have one more little segment at some point when we're completely done with the deck, but this area is now usable. Dogs are delighted. Doggy door accessible and everything. So. Everybody stay well.